Hi guys, welcome to my channel. It's William here. Today I've got a video for you on Heijin's custom AI avatar. So Heijin is pretty popular out there on how on creating custom AI avatars. And you can use yourself, you can use the pre-built ones. Today I'm going to show you how to set up your own in less than 15 minutes. So this is their main web page, very clean. You can see these are some of his AI videos, and let's play it out. Hey there, welcome to HeyGen, where you can easily create fun, high quality videos using our AI avatars and voices. In just a few clicks, you can generate custom videos for social media, presentations, education, and more. And you notice he's standing at, a, at an actual real background, like with, with a reflection of buildings and trees. It looks really natural, and it's a very good background to use. You can use it over and over again. I've, I've seen this particular video from time to time in all different scenarios, and it's really awesome. So let's quickly scroll through the web page, and I'll show you the instant avatar. So here we go. So play this one. Hey, this is what an instant avatar looks like. Yeah, so previously there was one standing, and this one is sitting, so you can have like different instant avatar postures which is quite good and then let's play some of the other ones so this is the instant avatar it's not going to be the studio type where you have a green screen at the back and you can naturally remove all the background here so the voice quality and the lip sync is not going to be as good as studio avatar but for the regular day-to-day -day use instant avatar, instant avatar is going to be good enough so let's have a quick look at Studio Avatar. Hey, this is what a Studio Avatar looks like. So that's probably the key difference. And then we've got the Photo Avatar, which is creating a fake photo and then just move, um, making the face move their eyebrows and their, their mouth as well. But today's focus will be on the Instant Avatar, so let's lock in. So this is the main dashboard for Heijin. You can create your instant avatar right here. You can see there's a free instant avatar spot, so you can click on that. Hey guys, I'm Joshua, co-founder and CEO of Heijin. Let me show you these two videos, and you tell me which one is AI generated. In the early days of computer programming, a significant historical anecdote is known as Grace Hopper and the bug. Yeah, I'm going to step that. He's trying to tell you that both of these videos are AI generated. But so let's get started. Here you got two options. You've got a video instructions and then there's a text instructions. So depending what you prefer, then you can choose on that one. It's going to tell you the do's and don'ts, what you should do, what you should do. I'll choose the text because I've seen the video instructions many times. So things you should do is Submit a footage around two minutes at least. Remember to use a high resolution camera. Use a well lit environment so it's bright enough to lit up your face. Look into the camera, not on the screen, not somewhere else because it's gonna look weird. I know it's hard, but you have to practice a few times. Remember to pause in between. So it allows the AI to capture those voices so your lips don't look weird. Try to use uh, generic gestures. Oh, this is really good. So there's a, a pop-up showing you how your hands should move. And things you should do is to stitch or cut your footage, talking without pauses, changing positions while recording, loud background noise, shadow overexposure on your face, uh, strange hand gestures, all that. Do not use any pointing gestures. All right, that's pretty very clear instructions and then just feel free to talk about any topics in your language relax be yourself look in the camera and then if you don't have a script or you don't know what to talk about there's a script they provide you but i would definitely think of something just to talk about instead of reading the script because it's not going to sound as natural as it will Okay, so right here you can either record it with your cam with your camera with your webcam directly or you pre-record yourself and then you can upload the footage. You can see it's the best quality that they recommend. But if you just want to try it quickly and see how it feels, then use the record with webcam. All right, so I've got my video 
clip recorded just now. I can just quickly play something like this. For us. I'm a content creator. So all you have to do is just drag it. So all you have to do is click on upload footage and then you can paste your link or drag and drop your video in here. Uh, looks like they have to use at least two minute video. So I have to record myself again. So let's track the video. Here's the footage. Face is visible all times. I'm looking, let's see. And you can use AI to generate your own. Yeah, the video, it should have not cut my head, but I'm gonna just use it anyways. I am looking directly at the camera. There are pauses between sentences. Environment is well lit and quiet. And before I hit every, before I hit the, my footage looks good. You can choose to allow HN to use your footage to optimize the AI model. I don't want to, so I just click next. And then this is a good uh, sort of production. It'll say that to prevent misuse of technology, we need to confirm the person in the video is you. So you can record a consent or upload a video consent here. So I just recorded myself really quickly. And then I think their background AI is going to validate if I'm the person who I am recording the consent, which is good. This will prevent like anyone trying to upload other people's face and then start creating different contents on behalf of someone else. So content looks good. So I hit submit. So video is uploading right now. So we'll be right back. All right, I think that took around 10, 15 minutes to upload everything based on your internet uh, upload speed. So right now it's been uploaded. I can click done. You can see it's 0% ready at this moment. So we'll just wait a bit to see when it's fully loaded, optimized and ready to go. So I'll be right back. And while we are on HGN's platform, I want to show you there are different features, uh, labs features they call. If you click on it, there are all these different tools, URL to video, text to image, uh, Canva integration, ChatGPT integration, translating videos directly. And the most up-to-date one is called personalized video. So you can think of something like if someone signed up with to your newsletters and you could use HGN to actually send out a message, a personalized message saying, for example, hey, William, thanks for signing up my newsletter or like, hey, John, hey, whatever. So it's a really powerful uh, video, a personalized video feature. If you're interested in this, I can do another video on this particular feature. So drop a comment down below. All right, looks like my avatar is ready. So let's click on my face. Hey, William. Your instant avatar is ready. Feel free to create videos with it. Also, click the feedback button to share what you think. Hope you enjoy. What do you think of that voice? It sounds like it turned me into a British accent. I know my accent is not either in Eng in US English or UK, but yeah, I think they, they put me on the, the more of the UK accent side. So let's click next. So we can do content marketing personal personalized video messages, L and D videos. So click next. You can always redo your avatar and you have the choice to upgrade to what they call a fine tune of your instant avatar. So better quality, better voice clone, and you can speak in 25 different languages. So I'll create myself in a landscape format. So basically I can have myself re recording all these videos every time. Notice that I'm in a free account right now. If you want to remove the watermark, you have to be a paid subscriber in HeyGen. The free account also gives you 720p instead of 1080p on the video quality. And if you want to go up to 4K, it's going to be a higher price, a higher price tier. So. 4K, you need to be on business, but for all the regular use like 1080p, 
you will be on the creator plan. And it looks like even the free plan will give you 1080p as well. I think previously they limit this to 720p. So I'll take that back, and which is good. So depending how much video you want to create, then you just select like how many credits. It's based on credits. So one credit is one like, almost equivalent to one minute. So you have to adjust this based on your need. How much videos are you creating every single month? Remember, these will refresh every single month if you pay monthly, if you pay by yearly. My understanding is that they'll give you like 360 credits if you sign up for the $48 a month plan, etc. So what we can do here is just create a script. I can click on the GBT script writer right here. I can type in like, write me a script explaining password and passkey and let the GPT-4 script writer do the hefty lifting work now and then we can click apply and close if we're happy with the script so let's remove some of these words so I want to show you the key difference between instant avatar and the studio avatar so you can see these ones are the instant avatar. These ones are the studio ones. If you want to click on my avatar and you want to use the different view mode, you'll notice there's close up, half body and circle view. If I choose this in circle view, and if I did my videos correctly, it wouldn't have cropped my head like this. And half body and close up is going to be the same because that's just the instant avatar setup. But you create a new scene and you put in, let's say, Blake. You will have Blake with a transparent background. You can choose him in close up, half body, circle view. So it's going to be much cleaner, much more higher quality than what you have in Instant Avatar. And that is the key difference. So jumping back to the pricing page again, sorry. Uh, free account will give you one instant avatar space and any pay plan under the creator subscription, you will get three instant avatars. If you're in the business plan, it's still three. Anything you want to go upwards, you have to go to the enterprise level, but either you could, you might, you might either ask HN if they allow more than three instant avatars. So remember to hit the preview button play the entire video. And if you're happy with this, click submit. So I have five credits left. It'll take 2.5 credits of my account. So I'll hit submit. So you can see it is generating the video. It's rendering right now it's at 54%. We will come back to this once it's fully completed. All right, that was quick. So two minutes and 12 seconds on this video and let's play it back. Welcome back to our video series on digital security. In today's episode, we will discuss the important concepts of passwords and pass keys. So let's dive right in. Segment one, passwords. Host. A password is a string of characters created by a user to authenticate their identity and gain access to a system, application, or online account. It acts as a barrier against unauthorized access and protects our sensitive information. Expert. When creating a password, it is essential to follow certain best practices. Avoid using personal information like your name or date of birth. Instead, opt for a combination of uppercase and lowercase letters, numbers, and special characters. Host. Furthermore, it's crucial to use unique passwords for different accounts to prevent a domino effect if one account gets compromised. Segment two, pass keys. Now let's talk about pass keys. Our personal and sensitive information. So be sure to create unique and robust passwords and use secure pass keys to protect your devices. Stay safe and see you in the next episode. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more informative content. And as always, stay vigilant and stay secure. So that's a quick overview of Heijan's Instant Avatar. I hope you found this video helpful. You found some good value. And whether you want to use Heijan or not, you can try this out. It's absolutely free. You only need to pay if you want the higher quality 
all the, the different features that I've mentioned in this video. So hope you like this, subscribe to my channel, like this video, and I'll see you in the next one.